New tonight, the Virginia Beach Crime Solvers recognized several police officers for cracking cases with tips from the crime line. Our very own Dan Kennedy emceed the award luncheon. Sarah Hammond tells us why the police chief calls those tips invaluable. When we report on a crime, you've heard us ask you to call 1-888-LOCK-YOU-UP or submit a tip through the P3 app hundreds of times. And last year, almost 900 of you did just in Virginia Beach. It is invaluable. Even with all of the new technology helping officers in Virginia Beach, it's hard to replace eyewitnesses to a crime. But Virginia Beach Police Chief Paul Newdigate says he understands how difficult it can be to come forward with information. So we understand some of the challenges that are out there about coming forward. But those concerns didn't stop 886 people from submitting tips over the phone or online last year. Through the Virginia Beach Crime Solvers, tips led police to clear 183 cases and arrest 75 people. They also recovered over $62,000 worth of stolen property, seized $97,000 worth of drugs and 23 firearms. We could not have the level of success, uh, the level of closure that we bring uh, without crime solvers. Police can't do it alone. We need the community. On Friday, the department honored two teams of officers who were able to solve crimes using those tips. Over the summer, a team of detectives and officers were able to arrest multiple suspects who were stealing from cars and slashing tires. Another team of officers arrested a suspect after a fatal hit and run. But this provides you a venue, an opportunity to remain anonymous, to receive compensation. But if you have information that can help us solve one of these crimes, particularly one of our violent crimes, I implore you, please come forward. Sarah Hammond, 13 News Now. And again, if you do have information about a crime, you can remain anonymous. Calls to the crime solvers are not traced or recorded. It's all done through a code number system. You could also get $1,000 if your tip leads to an arrest or recovery of stolen property. The nonprofit is funded entirely through public donations.